Hi, this is Sunny Dawson of SunnyDawson.com. I'm incredibly excited to introduce to you some of the pretty peaks of Barcelona. Barcelona is incredibly well known for an incredibly vibrant, fun, exciting city filled with beaches, um, great clubs, amazing old city, incredible artwork, um, the generation of absolutely amazing artists and architects like Gaudi, um, the, the uh, Sangrada Familia, La Rambla, all sorts of amazing places but it also has some incredible peaks uh, surrounding the north of the city and I'm really thrilled to introduce these to you. So if you um, want a little bit of respite, want some fresh air, come and enjoy some of these peaks that I'm about to show you. The first is El Puchet. Uh, El Puchet is in the north of Barcelona. It's a quiet uh, and well known to locals but not so much to tourists and it is an incredibly steep climb. It's got some picnic tails and put tables up the top but it's got some amazing views both to the north the uh, Tibidado and also over the, over the city into the sea so it's a lovely lovely climb and I hope you really enjoy it Thank you. second and most favourite pretty peak in Barcelona is the three crosses at the top of Park Gruel. It is an incredible, incredible view overlooking the entire city and also parts of the Park Gruel itself. Park Gruel is internationally known and for good reason. It is an incredible combination of rambling design and intentional flow by the incredible architect Antonio Gaudi. I just love being here and there's actually a number of peaks all around the park that you can visit for free. There's a section of the park that you have to pay for and that's the pretty pretty uh, colours and designs that are internationally known but the rest of the park and up the hills which are great climbs by the way, great for your legs, um, is, is a sensational sensational views over Barcelona so if you come to Park Gruel definitely check out the Three Crosses. <laughs> So my third pretty peak for Barcelona is to come up to Mount Juic. At the top of Mount Juic is the Mount Juic Castle and it was built in the 11th century and has been refurbished um, several times through military use. As you will see when you come up to the peak, uh, it is right on the top of a hill which is overlooking the port. And it's from this pretty peak that you can actually really fully appreciate how big the port of Barcelona is. It's absolutely massive and incredibly beautiful to see. Uh, from... many ways you can get up here. You can do it all by public transport, by catching uh, the L3 line to parallel, then the funicular from parallel up up the hill a bit more. You can either to catch the telephonic which takes you up the hill. You have to pay 12 euro return but it, you're awarded with fantastic views. Or you can catch the 150 bus and I've seen that there's some pretty nice views of the 150 bus too. So, And that's all integrated obviously in the um, public transport system here in Barcelona and check the times before you come because even in summer I got up here just before 8 and I thought it would be open for a few more hours but it wasn't so please before you come check the times even in summer busy season um, so you can have a chance to see and get a hold of the full view from the castle at the top. <laughs> So the fourth and by far not the least 
pretty peak in Barcelona is Mount Thibodeau. I absolutely love it here. It's absolutely phenomenal. The views over the city and the mountain ranges behind Barcelona is just incredible. It's totally worth coming up for the view. But if you've got a family or you love rides, there's a theme park here. It's a little Lexi, but um, a lot of people spend a whole day going on unlimited rides and having sugary sweets and all that great stuff. So I highly recommend coming up to Mount Thibodeau and there's many ways you can do it. You can do it by public transport, but also by funicular up and down. And of course that's a little bit more expensive, but it is a beautiful way to get up the hill. You can run it, walk it, or uh, bike it as well. So there's, there's a multitude of options, but I highly recommend if you come to Barcelona to uh, come to Mount Thibodeau. It's absolutely stunning.